Let's have some beer. Be going down, people of the world. My name is Redbeard, and this is yet another beer review. Thank you so much for joining me. Smash that thumbs up button in the face, and let's just get into it, shall we? For the beer of this day, we've got the first on my channel, but technically the second beer cracked open of my latest order from Bellwoods Brewing out of Toronto, Ontario. This is their pomegranate and lime that is just not going to focus on that part of the label at all. It's Jelly King. Pomegranate lime. 5.6% ABV. Yeah. I had a couple of beers earlier tonight, and um, this is the one that I really wanted to review before drinking. And I just realized now my bottle opener is not really in my eye line at all. Just a sec. It wasn't my line of sight, just underneath something. So. The bottle cap, it's a very typical Bellwoods bottle cap. It's a bell, because Bellwoods, bell, Bellwoods, witty. Let's see what we have got. I have had several variants of Jelly King up to this point, and none of them have been bad. Some have been better than others. That that's that's got a pretty nice promising appearance to it. I don't know what to say about the small little bubbly patches on the glass. I washed this shit. I guess I just didn't wash it well, apparently. I'm sorry. I get lime. I cannot recall the last time I cracked open and ate a fresh pomegranate. I have done it before, though. It's a delicious fruit, but it's been a while. I get lime. I get something else. I assume that's pomegranate, and I get funky sour. Stink. What do you want to call it? I like the smell of that. Let's give it a shot. Holy shit. Yes. Oh my god. I wasn't ready for that. That has got one of the most... Punch you when the mouth sour hits I have had in a long time. And get lime flavor, and it, it's got it. It's pomegranate. It, it must be. It's there. And it's delightful. Let's do this. Cheers, everybody. Oh my. Yes. Yes. I don't want to, I can't, I don't know if I can say with any definite, it's been a while since I've had, well, I had the, the, the plum, <clears throat> plum cherry one recently. This destroys that one. Strawberry kiwi. That was good, I remember, but like the sour hit on this and it, the lime and then the pomegranate leavings just lingering. I think this might be my favorite Jelly King. Oh, Bellwoods. Oh, Bellwoods. You glorious bastards. What do we got here? Water, barley malt, wheat malt, oats, pomegranate puree, lime puree, yeast hops, contains barley, wheat, oats. 
Jelly King is a juicy dry hop sour with punchy hopper aromatics and top tropical fruity flavors. To this batch, we added a healthy dose of pomegranate lime for ex exponential fruit enjoyment. They say the same thing every time. That's mildly unimpressive. Is there a date? Oh, there should be a date. Yes, 21st of September. 18th of September. I mean, October. It's day. So, yeah, that's that's like a month old. Did they say 18th? Did I see that? 21st. Sorry. So it's like, it's just under a month old, actually. Oh, this is probably the most, this is an IPA. I got an IPA, maybe one, maybe two IPAs. This and maybe two other beers are the most normal beers I got in the current Bellwoods order I got. I got some weird Rhett Namas' beers and some wild ales. And like I was talking saying before, way before, way before, beginning of the freaking review, I think, maybe, I got a bottle of Donkey Venom, which is Bellwood's strong, dark, sour ale. And the review of that was done at Nick's place. But I'm pretty sure I have the video. I'm pretty sure I did it for my channel. So I also got a barrel aged version of that. And then he has some like weird wild barrel aged viney thing. I don't even know what the hell they are. I'm going on a bit of a wild. There we go, wild ale. A wild Bellwoods ride with some of the more recent ones I got. Because you know what? life too short i want to try different styles and things and stuff i haven't tried before because why the hell not this is this the yeah oh what do we got untapped are we got people gonna agree with me 3.96 173 ratings yet again me being in this kind of little club, I like it. Like, there's so many beers out there where it's like tens of thousands of people have had it. Like me, it's like, oh, look at me. I'm special. This is 10. This is this 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 is the most delicious sour beer I have had in a very, very, very long time. It's kind of perfect. And uh if you've had it agree or disagree in the comments down below because we're done thanks so much for watching like if you liked dislike if you like did, did dislike if you like to you know did, did, just likes and dislikes all around for everybody sure subscribe if you're not subscribed bell notification all that fun stuff and i'll be back with something like this pretty freaking soon peace out Pulled up my channel and apparently I've only had four. I had the OG Jelly King, then Raspberry Blackberry, then Pineapple Tangerine, Strawberry Rhubarb, then that one Plum Cherry, whatever it was, and now this one. Apparently they made a peach one. I want to have that one, but I can't. Extra first world problem. Man.